and court is timing out that incoming storm. That's right, and Kelly, it's not going to be too long before you might want to have the umbrella handy across our region. In fact, I would get it ready with you and take it out the door this morning. A live look outside early on today, the Sundial Bridge in Reading, where it's just been absolutely spectacular for getting out and about over the last couple of days. That's not going to be the case today. Reading is going to see some very decent moderate to heavy shower activity and even a chance for thunderstorm activity today as well. So that is something you want to keep in mind. A gorgeous look right now. Clouds covering our region overhead this morning. And that cloud cover has left us with some milder temperatures as it's acting as the blanket to trap in the heat overnight. Winter storm warning going into effect at 11 a.m. this morning, lasting through 11 a.m. Thursday across the northern Sierra down to 5,500 feet. And that's due to the potential for snowfall heavy enough to cause some travel impacts. Now on the west side or east side, that is, of Siskiyou County, we also have a winter weather advisory in effect through 11 p.m. tonight. Temperatures in the 50s across the board for the valley, 57 degrees in Redding, 54 for Chico. And again, the reason why we're starting out warmer is that cloud cover trapping in the heat. 40s in the foothills, 30s to 40s in our mountain zones and wind out of the southeast down to 12 miles an hour in Chico. Winds starting to pick up this morning up to 25 miles an hour out of the southeast at 9 a.m. Towards the afternoon, we're looking at gusts up to around 40 miles an hour. So be prepared. The winds are going to be kicking up quite a bit. Those winds not quite as strong tonight, but then picking back up into the 25 to 30 mile an hour range tomorrow and then lighter winds on Friday, but still wet weather persisting across our region. Satellite and radar, I'm tracking some showers extending into western Shasta County from Trinity County right now. Most showers are still hung up in that band along the coast at the moment, and they're going to be tracking to the south and east as this wet system closes in on the coast. And then later in the week, that's going to start to slide south off the coast, leaving us with showers continuing to extend further to the south towards southern California. So right now, again, showers in Shasta, Trinity, and Siskiyou County zones. The same area is still impacted through 8 a.m., but mid-morning, we're seeing showers extending further to the south, and by noon, we've got showers intruding into northern Butte County, already spreading through Tama County, Glen County, Shasta County, and through the northern Sierra. This afternoon, some pockets of heavier rain, even a slight threat of thunderstorms on the way. You can see at 5 p.m., still seeing rain in Redding and the east side of the valley as well. Some in Red Bluff and heavy snow in the mountains. Heaviest snowfall later today through tonight, and then it's more scattered shower activity through the day tomorrow. So not quite as substantial or heavy, but some pockets of rain still likely tomorrow with scattered lighter showers. And then we'll see shower chances persisting Friday into early Saturday before fizzling out for the most part for the majority of our region. Sunday for Easter, save for maybe a few light showers in the northern Sierra during that time. And then really drying out and warming up early next week. So rain and snow showers with breezy southeast winds for the northern mountains. 40s to low 50s for your highs there. We'll end up with rain and snow showers across the Sierra. 4,500 feet looks to be where we could expect to see snow, but the heaviest snow above 5,000 feet and highs mostly in the 40s. 40s to low 50s in the foothills with rain showers and a slight chance for thunderstorms and mid to upper 50s for the valley. Those are the highs today and those are mostly right now. Looks like we'll be cooling down this morning and then not warming up back to this extent heading into the afternoon. So highs in the 50s for the valley today. Getting a look at your storm tracker seven day forecast where your weekend's always in view. Not as cool tomorrow with more scattered showers, heavier showers than likely again Friday and early Saturday. Warming back into the lower 60s Saturday with conditions drying out and then mostly sunny with mid to upper 60s for Easter Sunday. Warming into the 70s to lower 80s with sunshine early on next week. So Kelly, it is spring in Northern California and we see these kind of impacts happening where it's a roller coaster of temperatures and sky conditions across our region. And that's what's going on in your seven day. Keeps everybody happy, right? No complaints. Well, something for everyone. That's right. Okay, thanks, Court.